Good day everyone, I am Elizabeth Ozamara from NR13 and now I will demonstrate on how to assess peripheral pulse. In assessing peripheral pulse, first you need to assess the patient. And then, you need to consider the following. The clinical signs of cardiovascular alterations, factors that might alter pulse rate, site most appropriate for assessment, and the site that most appropriate for the assessment are the pulse points. And then you need to assemble the equipment needed. The equipment needed is the second a watch with second hand indicator. And then you need to identify yourself and verify the client's identity. Explain to the client what you're going to do, why is it necessary, and how the client can cooperate. So this is my patient. Good morning, sir. I am your nurse for today, Elizabeth Ozamora. May I know your name, sir? I'm Renzo Martinez. Your birthday, sir? December 7, 1960. And then after that, you need to perform hand hygiene. You need also to observe the other appropriate infection control procedures. And next, provide for clients' privacy. And then, we need to select the pulse point. There are nine different pulse points, which are the temporal, carotid, brachial, popliteal in the um, lower extremities, pedal, posterior tibial, femoral, radial, here, here is the radial, and the apical pulse. After selecting the pulse point, we, um, you can now start the assessing of peripheral pulse. I will now choose the um, brachial part of the patient. Assist the client to a, to a comfortable resting position. Palpate and count the pulse. Count for 15 seconds and multiply by 4. Record the pulse in bits per minute on your worksheet. If taking a client's pulse for the first time, or if obtaining baseline data, or if the pulse is irregular, count for a full minute. An irregular pulse also requires taking the pulse. So now we will mm, get the peripheral pulse of the patient for 15 seconds. And after that, assess the pulse rhythm and volume. Document the pulse rate, rhythm, and volume and your actions in the client record. I hope you have learned something from my videos. Thank you for watching. Bye!